Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how you can uh, set up BSPWM, uh, the binary space partition in Window Manager, on uh, FreeBSD. So I have a virtual machine here. I'm going to show you this in the uh, this VM. So I'm going to just boot this uh, VM. So we can see how we can do it. I'm not going to set up uh, a bar or anything. I just so you, show you the basics, and you can do the bar by yourself or uh, customize it however you like. Let me just log in and put my password and let's uh, install BSPWM. Uh, let's do let's do as and pkg install and BSP WM and of course we need to install SXHKD and uh, that's it you can install a bar but I'm not going to do that uh, I'm going to just hit enter I already did this before so just so I can save a little bit of time because this is a quick video I don't want to be too long so let's uh, cd into that config or we'll just create a directory in the dot config so mkdir and that config and we call it bspwm okay so we can put the configuration for bspwm in there and let's also create another directory called sxhkd and uh, now let's copy the example files from just use cp and slash user. This is uh, FreeBSD. Let me just show you this is FreeBSD. <laughs> so uh, let's copy the uh, example file. I think it's local. Some share, I think, example. And BSPWM and BSPWM RC. Let's copy to our home directory and that config and bspwm and let's also copy the uh, sxhkd example it's in bspwm and sxhkd rc and slash home sh that config and sxhkd okay now let's take a look at that let me just remove just use the text editor of course bspwm bspwmrc okay this is the configuration for bspwm so and I'm going to leave this thing as it as it is i'm just going to delete this one now because i don't use the gimp or any of these stuff remove this last one and just save and exit. You can uh, change, of course, that configuration however you like. Don't to look at uh, SXHKD and SXHKDRC. I'm not going to use URXVT, I'm going to use ST. And I'm going to use BSPWM, change the, just the key binding to P. You, I'm going to use the Alt key, not the Alt, not Alt. The Alt instead of the, the logo key. Just to replace that. And uh, to kill a window, I'm going to use Alt. And not W, but C. And go down just so we so I can switch the stops with the the alt and the number. Yeah, I missed it there. Okay, just type alt and save this. Of course, you can change it to whatever key bindings you want. And now you can use a display manager or any display manager you want to start BSPWM.
but I'm going to use uh, the xmitrc file. So just create one, use your text editor and type uh, .xmitrc. The first thing we want to do is just uh, exec, do exec PSP WM. And before that, you need to do SXHKD. Okay, this is the different thing about uh, open B free BSD or any other, like uh, open BSD or something like that. It's not the same way you do it in uh, Linux. Okay, I'm, as uh, I'm going to set a wallpaper, so I'm going to use fair and dash pg and dash fill and I'm going to specify where that uh, uh, background image is in my home directory dot files I think I'm going to skip uh, dot files let's just do that and I think images background background and image dot png and the end and also I'm going to start a, a compositor icon and you just do this if you are doing this in a, a real machine or bare metal but as you can see this is a VM so I have to do this dash 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 no vsync and I'm going to set the resolution because this is a VM and the resolution is not going to be set and use xranda slash output and virtual dash one and dash mode and 19 1980 This line is uh, just specific because uh, this is a VM and this also dash dash no vsync. And I think that's it for this uh, config. Let's save and exit. Now all we have to do is just type start x and start bspwm. Okay, as you see, you can see we started the BSPW. I'm just going to hit Alt and Enter to start uh, SD, the terminal. Let's do a new fetch so you can see. As you can see, this is BSPWM, and the terminal I'm using is SD. Let's start another terminal. Let's type htop. Okay, this is BSPWM. As you can see, let's open another terminal. And uh, as you can see, I'm using D menu. And uh, let's launch Chrome. Let's, let's close this one first. And let's launch Chromium. Okay. And I think this is uh, it for this video. You can uh, start a bar, uh, install a bar like a polybar or something like that. Uh, it's the same thing, the, the same way that you configure polybar in uh, GNU slash Linux is the same same way. You create a directory inside your dot config and you put the launch script and polybar config file in there, and you do this for uh, the BSPWM RC configuration. Okay, uh, this is it for this uh, video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.